Hi guys, I know it's been a while, but we are back with some more Dark Side Detective. We are going to play these bonus levels, which I'm pretty excited about. Um, so thank you guys so much uh, for uh, sticking around, and I'm sorry it's been a while, but here we go. Okay, case summary. Christmas Eve is the perfect time for some last minute shopping, right? Let's do this. My heart was a vengeance. Whew, Christmas Eve. Perfect for some last minute holiday shopping. <sighs> when I was a kid, holiday shopping meant buying new trunks for the beach. When you were a kid, something something old people. Let's go see Santa! <laughs> oh my god. I can't wait to watch movies and eat candy all day. <clears throat> And help my mom with dinner. <laughs> I hope Santa got my letter. Oh, I hope so too. Halt, shoppers! What is the nature of your visit? Shopping, shopping for last-minute Christmas gifts. Clearly, hmm. Your story checks out. Just remember, I'm the law around here. My cameras cover twenty-six percent of this place. <laughs> Not everything happens without my knowing about it. Julie, don't go in there. Oh, so now we're too good to search in bins all of a sudden. <laughs> They've really gone all out this year. I know, much better than last year's lone light and cardboard treat. You can really smell the plastic off of this one. Okay. Can I have one of those for Christmas? No way, mister. Last year you got a robot and forgot to take care of it. it ended up having to wash it for you. Hey, that's why I short-circuited. I do love me some Christmas music. I know, buddy. You've been playing them in the car since Halloween. Yeah, you're right. I did leave a pre late start this year. Warning, do not do a crime, shoppers. A crime is for life, not just the holidays. <laughs> Thank goodness there's a map. These places are huge. I always get lost. Dude, the mall is only 20 screens big. <laughs> I love that. Oh. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? You know it. Photo montage! I love this. Dorks. They do it again. Oh my god. Why is, is the ground so far in? If I was here, if it was here, I'd be there by now. Gah! Where to first, detective? Well, ground floor is a food court, fountain in the arcade, upstairs are the shops and the cinema. Grotto and center over there. Come on, guys. I guess we keep going to the grotto for now. Oh, food. Hot dogs, burgers, turkey legs, all sound so delicious. I don't know what to order. You just can't ignore all that. We got, we got stew. <laughs> what? It's a hearty winter treat. What flavor is it? Don't know. Just said stew. I <laughs> can't just said stew. I'll just have a soda. And gaso sodas only got stew. Fizzy stew? I didn't think this was possible. But I've lost my appetite. Oh my god. A free copy of the Twin Lakes Times. Grab me a copy, will ya? I want to read the sports results. Oh. Good to know. If Uncle Patrick stops for food, we'll never get to the grotto in time to see Santa. I wasn't hungry until the screen loaded. <laughs> Use a bag dog, mate. We have all the varieties. Egg flavored, non flavored, um, milk flavored? Agnes, what are you doing here? I work here when the camps is closed. The camps is closed? I need to make a few phone calls. He'll be here any minute, right? No, Devin. No, he won't. <laughs> that means Christmas abandonment badges! Yay! <laughs> oh my god. Milky egg liquid with the taste of the holidays. Okay. Whoa, that is impressive. It goes as far as the eye can see. Dooley, it doesn't even touch the root. As far as the eye can see. <laughs> Those decorations are pretty impressive, right, Dooley? That's nothing compared to the tree I'm decorating when we get home tonight. Wait, it's Christmas Eve, you don't have a tree up yet? I think you'll find I have seven up so far, but for a nice tree, I'm pulling out all the stops. <laughs> I've never seen a bidet with that much power before. Free gifts, our job here is done. Nope, they're empty. On we go. They must have been growing this year in secret for ages when they brought it in through the skylight. Growing for the longest time. <laughs> My gifts better be as big as the ones under that tree, Uncle Patrick. They're almost as big as you are, Buzz. And? <laughs> oh my god. It's all I hope for and more. Let's go! 
Detective, don't lick that place. Why would I lick it? Well, it looks like gingerbread. Yeah, but it's just because it looks like gingerbread doesn't mean it's you licked it, didn't you? If it looks like gingerbread. <laughs> Why are you wasting all this time standing around? There's a sand in there that needs clossing. Welcome to Santa's Grotto where all your dreams come true. <sighs> Roll on quitting the clock. <laughs> okay. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas, one and all. The Jolly Red Meal Ticket. Look at this fine trio of lads. I hope you've been good all year. Good. We've been great. We need some city s serving size goodies in the stocking this year, Santa. City saver, huh? You must be Detective McKing. I kid, I kid. I know who you are, Francis. I'm Santa. I see all. I was just being a jerk for funsies. <laughs> <sighs> Guys, Santa's got a busy schedule. Join the queue and wait your turn, yeah? Okay, Buzz, you heard the happy elf. Get in your queue and we'll go grab gifts for you and your mom. Are you okay to leave him here on his own? Detective, his twin legs at Christmas. What could possibly go wrong? Oh yeah, we're leaving him anyway. <laughs> Uncle of the year here. Who? Where? Maybe I can get some tips because I suspect I need them. <laughs> oh my god. I saw him once, you know, as a kid. Christmas of 47. What? Yeah, he was on a trial. My father, a small time law. Dooley, I'm going to stop you right there. Your dad was a history professor at NTLU. You're telling me the plot of Miracle on 34th Street. Huh, I guess that explains why I remember it all black and white. <laughs> Guys, get out of here. You're embarrassing me in front of all the capitalists. <laughs> I hope my hands stall before I beat Santa. I hate to accidentally drop my gift. Or worse, give a weak handshake. You only get this one first impression. <laughs> is is Carl the one in Jimmy Neutron that loves um Carl and Sheen, right? That, and Carl likes Jimmy's mom. So all I can think is... I hope my hands fall out before I meet Santa, cause I want to see Jimmy's man. <laughs> you're next, kid. What? I said you're next. Okay, Mister. Just let me know when I'm next. I can't wait. <laughs> From an orderly queue, children and a uh, bigger children. I hate my life. Ho ho ho! Merry Christmas, one and all. What a good pair of boys you are, huh? Sh saving the city, week in and week out. Wait, how did you know about that? Let's just say wink. <laughs> I hate when people say wink. You can blame the low resolution for that. <laughs> That's one fancy seat. Cup holder, heated seat, back massager. It has all the functions. It has to be in case he needs to, you know, go on the uh, job. <laughs> okay. Oh. Well. Arcade? Why would anyone want to alarm a fire? These things are dangerous when spooked. <laughs> Oh my god. I spent a lot of time here when I was younger. I was younger last weekend. Always growing, I am. <laughs> I loved our kids as a kid. Okay, I still love them. Can we go? Can we? Can we? Can we? Must we search every bin we see? Yes! I want to go in the arcade. Face invaders. Oh my god. I'm so excited. Told you this. Oh my god, now I'm scared. Oh my god, they're really they're really going for it, dude. Zombie munch. Oh my god. Yes.
can't stop playing this. so loud. I am sorry for the loudness there. Why is there a kid in there? Eh, he crawled in there when I wasn't looking. But Dada, you told me to go in there and pass out the goodies. Would you shut up? Kids just say the damnedest things. <laughs> hey, Detective. Hey, Blood Alpha. Emily, what are you doing here? Dad took me and baby brother to see Santa, but Santa's lame, so now we're trying to steal toys with a claw machine. Excited for Christmas? Ugh, I hate Christmas. Everyone is off with their families. The weather is poop. We have to go around with Dad's stealing stuff to put it under the tree. Rubbish time of year. What about Santa? She's really excited for his visit. Santa's a sham, detective. Sometimes I worry about your detective skills. Maybe if you were nicer and didn't rob arcades, he'd visit. I don't see how those things are linked. <laughs> Did you ask Santa for anything nice? That chimp doesn't always write me, so I don't write to him. Besides, it's a bit grand, isn't it? Flying all over the world, giving kids gifts. What past crime you trying to cover up? Crimson pants? <laughs> see you guys later. The arcade is the most wonderful place on earth. I mean, true. Hey, buddy, can't you see I'm busy stealing? Oh, hello, officer. <laughs> Out of order. Aw, oh, Rampage of Monkeys, my favorite game here. Just want to see if I can play it. Okay. I guess we could go. Oh. What was that? Screen shake. We better go make sure Buzz is okay. Fair. What the? What the heck's going on here? Christmas comes well once a year, but this time Krampus is here. Krampus, obviously. <laughs> you might think I'm, I'm going barmy, but I've come to make an army. I've turned these rotters into gnomes and send them back to the terrorize their homes. <laughs> uh, buzz no buzz. Wahaha. <laughs> Me go play and break some things. Shocker. Well, where'd Buzz go? We better find him. Stay away from Big Boss Man. He doesn't like kids. What, you already see through his disguise? I need to lie to you, clever man. Know what's what? Now hop off. <laughs> Merry Christmas, butts and ghouls. Let's mess this place and wreck these fools. Oh, pile of gifts. Stay away from my festive packets or I'll stuff you in a box and wrap it. <laughs> oh my god, wait, hold on. What did he say? What, he's gonna say anything new? Boy, Buzz sure is acting out today. <laughs> hey, stop throwing stuff at us. N uh you visit St. Nick, then I throw a brick. Shame that he's all fake. <laughs> For Christmas dinner, I'm gonna eat your teeth. My teeth? That there don't let oh. Are they all okay? They're fine in here. Okay, so I don't have to worry about talking to them because they're fine in here right now. Let's go up, I guess. Roof access is locked. Boy, oh boy, I love watching Christmas films at Christmas. They're good all year long, but at Christmas, for some reason, at Christmas just feel right. Guy light the movie coming soon. Are you bringing Doris? Shut up. <laughs> yes. The box must be doing very well if it has an office of its own. I wonder what the view is like. <laughs> Rabble Rouser 2. Needle face on earth. I don't even understand any of that means. It's scary though, right? Let's go into the cinema. Repent now and find salvation. On now. The end days are coming. Also on now. Chant ye of little faith and summon gruel at the end timer. Also now. These aren't screen times, are they? No, just life advice. All hail gruel the end timer. <laughs> the butterfly kisser. The paranormal PI. What a dumb premise. Sea biter. <laughs> Doesn't taste the same since they banned butter and salt and the cord. They can't be that bad. Try some. Okay, one popcorn, please. One popcorn coming right up. Let's try this. Oh, I'm not. Let's well, rotten. Yeah, we have to bend over here, especially for the popcorn. You can keep the tub. <laughs> ah, yes, the silver screen, the bronze broadcast, the golden gate bridge. Wait, what was I talking about? What candies and sodas do you have? Nothing. This is all fake. Put the real stuff away when I lace it to help customers see the truth. Oh my god. That's a trophy for our award-winning popcorn. Award-winning. Popcorn that tastes, at least tastes like popcorn. They didn't specify I had to taste good. Their mistake was arcane. <laughs> Welcome to the cinema. All for the day is that cops pay double. That's a good... Is that a good deal? No. Cops out. Hey, I know you. You were in a cult I busted up last year. The Brotherhood of the World's in. We're not a cult. We're an alternative religion. <laughs> Focused on bringing about the end of the world through ritual chanting and sacrifice. Yeah, what's your point? It's full of popcorn, and now I know why. <laughs> oh, I can't go in. Oh, Sag. I guess I don't have a ticket. Candyland. No way I have to go in. We have to. 
Oh my god. Nope. Oh, I mean to do that. This way. Back to this way. Candyland, do we need our passports to enter? <laughs> Smithy, good to see you out about, Brigadier. You too, old chap. After that running with old Jerry, I decided it was time to leave that hut and come see what life out here in the colonies had to offer. How are you finding it? Well, I joined the small walking club, but all we do is stand around while Rose here gives Roger cookie dough and goo goo eyes. I need some real action. Frontline stuff. You can come teach the Blood Wolves some survival tactics. Fight some wolves, you say. Count me in. <laughs> Mickey Nugget. Detective, I haven't seen you since you ruined my pre-retirement party. Pre-retirement? Pre-retirement. The early party in case you don't make it through those last few days. <laughs> oh, yeah. Sorry about that. It's okay. When I was your age, I was a maverick, too. Don't let the rules get you down. Speaking of rules, you still have your sidearm? Yes, sir. Rules. Out the window with that. That's my motto. But your gun. Like a samurai, you and I. Following our own path. Making our own way. Oh, my God. Om nom nom. Oh, a gentleman caller. And here's me stuffing my face with cookie dough. Don't stop on my account. Would you... Would you like some? No, thank you. Oh. I love candy and I love to share it with the world. Except you, for your own good, of course. I'm so conflicted about this. This is a wonderland. So we have candy. I want to try them all. Heaven's zone, not for you. Gotta keep your boys in blue dice fit. Can't have crime able to outrun you. Boys, don't touch some cakes. There's calories in that icing you don't need. <laughs> Having trouble getting your children sticky enough? Not if you give them candy flus. Oh. Candy flues, yeah. Cotton candy makes gloop guaranteed. Just add water. Yes. Did you just steal that? Now something like this is more your style. You can keep it in your pocket. Take it out on a break. Have a little lick and put it back in for tomorrow. Like that should last you a month if you control yourself. You can share one. Aside each. <laughs> Want. No chance. It's like a nightstick for your teeth. Gotta keep those smiles fresh when you're on the paper for capturing bad guys. My, my, my. Two of TLPD's finest in my store. Wooey, for you, everything's on the house. Yes, or at least it would be if I sold healthy food stuff. Can't have you two bastions vlogging unfit on my watch. Oh, no. Aww. This is, oh, yeah. Okay. Is that it? I love it. There he is. He's trying to reach the star from the tree. Ugh, he's too far out of reach, detective. Hmm, he's right under the sky. Maybe I can grab him from up on the roof? That's an impressive, what is it called? Reach? Spray? Plumage? The tree and fountain are below us and in front of us. You get down here, right, you get down from there right now, young man. An impressive star. I can see why Buzz wants it. Oh. Nothing up there. Okay, let's go into the gardening. Wind chimes, little by rare Tibetan metal peckers, like woodpeckers, but for metal and from Tibet. <laughs> Picked them up when I was hiking with Mildred. Of course, she came home alone. She's shacked up with a monk. <gasps> Holy man, my eye. <laughs> oh, lie. I thought I was buying something else at the time. My defense at nightclub was a strange place to sell pottery at 2 a.m. <laughs> he was part of a pair, but they were torn apart by economical differences. He shells up, up top gnomes, but that's not going to get him anywhere, is it? Daisies aren't a fancy plant, that's for sure, but they're sturdy. Add a nice smell and color to the place, too. Can't go wrong with a daisy, no sir. Unless you mean Daisy Miller. Girl broke my heart, unless she did. Woo wee, I'm gonna have a wrench one day, you mark my words. What? Oh, nothing, just flower talk. Perfect for landscaping and burying bad mistakes. Ah, the trial. Child, civil, or pocket spade, depending on your country of origin. Oh my god. Don't even ask about the watering can. That relationship still has to be tender. That's second hand from my old car washing business. The fun John, T Tanya, and I had that summer splashing and another was unexpectedly. Then, of course, they ran off with each other and that was the end of that. I might need something like this to kind of reach. Mind if I take it? Please do. Nothing but bad memories for me in the house. <laughs> Weeping cacti. Bread of myself. Well, was Jorge. Back in our harder cultural days. I don't like to think about that. Such heartbreak. This poor man. Look at that happy couple. Power couple in the world of gnomes. That's the name. Guardians began. That's the bridge. Can't beat an old four-way of a Tuesday night. This is my shop. Built from a lifetime of memories. Most good, some bad. But that's life, right? I love it. I went to school with Ned. Ned the nerd, we called him. Well, hey there, Patrick. Nice to see you in the store again. More seeds for the Blood Wolves? Uh, or not today, thanks. We'll be buying this freaking for perfume material. I've already put it in the order. You and this kid's really brightened my heart. Thanks, Ned. What? I've grown a lot since then. <laughs> Toys. Robots are great gifts. Hint. <laughs> they seem like little psychics. A Jimmy psychic. Almost like a psychic for your psychic. Hint, hint. I want one. Hint. For Christmas. Hint, hint. <laughs> a train with square wheels. Pfft, dumb. I feel like that bear is staring right into my soul. <laughs> 
friendly dinosaur. Clearly, these guys weren't junior paleontologists like me, trying to ascribe human rights of reptiles, typically human centric notions, above the food court. Oh my god, that fucking looks like. Ah! I love it! Leaders of the multiverse action figures. Only only wears pants man and arch nemesis skull for a face, but otherwise not a skeleton. Buzz would love these that came here with Fortress Base Skull playset. Never seen a person smile that much while also crying. <laughs> I just love my job so much. They got such real children laughing, hearing the toys repeat the same stock phrases, the bear whispering dark thoughts in my ear. <laughs> it's a kind of paradise, a kind of one. <laughs> puzzle rectangle. Cur a painfully colorful puzzle. Space man. What I give to go into space. Eh? Dark isolation space, no kids, no toys, no lights. Limited supply of air. <laughs> Oh man, I love this guy. Undisputed king of the dinosaurs. And dinosaurs didn't even reserve political hierarchies or dynasties. An orange brontosaurus. Why don't you just give him a rocket pack if you're going to make stuff up? Jeez. <laughs> what a country this was way back then. When men were men, didn't take orders from stuffed teddy bears. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, Mr. Bear. I know you only make those things as punishment. Round good. Yes, sir. <laughs> I know these toys Buzz collects them. They're robots that turn into slightly different looking robots. Oh yes, I see. This one changes from a truck with a container. Oh, sorry. To a truck without a container? The stuff of wonders. A tea set? I know. I'd love to sit for a cup too, Dooley, but not until we fix all this weirdness here. I'm holding you to that. Do. A very fancy chair. Sturdy too. I would have to thought baking an oven was anything but easy to start with. How would it fit in itself? <laughs> Ah, jump ropes. Trying to trick kids into exercising since man invented rope. Rope is always useful, so I'll grab some of this if you don't mind. Huh? Me? Complain? Not in front of the bear? No siree? Haha, <laughs> 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 this guy tells me what to do, and folks, let me tell you, it's not always pleasant. Haha, uh, isn't Christmas great? Chirpy music all season, and so many flashing lights, constantly disoriented. <laughs> Can't recall the last time I saw daylight. <laughs> As a person who works in retail during the holidays, this is so accurate. Oh my god. Ooh. Ho, ho, ho. Merry bye, miss. Don't forget to ask your parents for all the biggest toys as Christmas children. No expense is too much if they love you. <laughs> Brickman's Christmas Roundup. Bringing you... Oh, my God. Hold on. Top news and events from the past year. Oh, I love this show. I wonder if they get a mention. You do not. Ah, no fair. <laughs> the CB has a printout of a newsroom where the glass should be. Catamon, Catamon, she will fight the cosmic star. Her claws are made from tears of moon, protect daylight from singery fire. She pledges, licks a fury. Foreign cartoons are odd. Uh, you just gotta lean into the oddness. It's all, open your heart to it. Uh, my favorite show is on. That's the local bus times. And there's a lot to see and do around the city. Tactic, you hop on a random bus yourself someday. Imagine getting somebody a gift from an appliance store. Ha, <laughs> yeah. I should go back to tech shop for a second. <laughs> what other features would you like to see? Can it look up the sports results? Of course. Just open this menu, scroll to here, type your personal data, and ask a question. Using 32 characters or less, including spaces. Then your question is sent through the Encyclopedia Britannica headquarters where a person looks up and replies. There you go. Sit. Now we should wait for the answer. This may take a few units of time. <laughs> wow, it's so big you can almost see the pixels. They shouldn't sell this detonation equipment in a place like this. I love this place. Wonder what new gadgets I can find to rig out the Popo Moto with. Come on, Dooley, just got the hang of using the police scanner. You're such a Luddite detective. True, but the no in technology. I prefer to clean my vacuums by hand. Oh my god. These are just like the cameras we use to tell if an area is high crime or not. The ones that they wall mount and then count the numbers of days until somebody steals them. Very same. <laughs> Oh, wait, hold on. We're still investigating videos crimes against you. <laughs> oh my god, the references. These are the same lamps we have in the station's here interrogation cells. Actually, this might be handy. Oh my god. Excuse me, sorry, what are you doing? You can't just take that. We're a confiscating it for police investigation. <laughs> Do you know the sports results? All I want to know is sports did this season. Is that it? Where are my sports results? They're they're on their way. Just gotta have a little patience. Oh, okay, well. All hell crap, it's the king of Christmas chaos. Hmm. 
Okay, let's see. Uh, I need water? Oh, wait. Could I get... Uh... Hmm. Hold on. I'm just trying to see. There's no way I'm doing that. Okay. So now. Oh, wait. Water. Fuck. Okay, candy floss fountain sounds like a good enough reason to me. Uh, Rubble turn all soggy. Garden hose? There's no way I'm doing that. Ah, kills me every time. <laughs> Nobody's buying that as a solution. Okay, so not that. Uh, eh? No. Oh, wait. Um... Huh. It's locked. Some member of staff around here is bound to have a key. Oh, I should probably just ask. Welcome to the cinema. Cops have blah, blah, blah. Nope. So, he doesn't know. I wonder if it's... Oh, that's the dad. Um... Okay. So not these guys. You? Still connecting. Any minute now. Sports results. Woo! Just another moment. Bear with me. Bear with me. Sports results. Just another moment. Oh my god. Okay. It's not that way. Maybe you? The Chris was great. Yeah. Okay. Good. Not you. Um, this? Closer down below. So that's what I'm supposed to do. It just doesn't say, like, why. Okay, let's see. Okay, not you. You? No. I'm sorry I got the cotton candy mix from... I know it's probably something obvious. Hmm. Oh, I bet you. Hold on. I bet you. I do this and then do this. Uh, this? So I feel like something over where the balcony is. Let's see, where's. Does it not say where this balcony is over? Oh, I think this is over the thing. Can't do that. Hmm. The food court. It doesn't reach. Yes. Yes. That bag of beautiful milk. For the season that keeps on giving. Okay, so. No. Okay. Damn. I can't. 
this. Oh, I can have this. Um. Hmm. Uh. Do I need to, like, put the milk in something? Piss somebody off? Okay, so not that. her. Okay. Sticky milk on things? here? Uh. Oh, wait. Give it to sports. Here you can find the information you want. Sports results. Woo! <laughs> Try another set on Lou. It's like people don't want to pay $3,000 for a bit of rubbish tech without it being some kind of ludicrous sad symbol. Yuck, you again. You didn't cause any harm today already? Uh. Digital clock? How's digital clock tell the time? It only has ones and zeros. Tell me that. Latest portable cell phone technology. That's portable? It's huge. It comes with its own carry case, complete with wheels. <laughs> um, I'm gonna figure this out. Even if I freaking do everything at once. So the dude left. Is he down here now? No. Is it obvious that I'm just... Hmm. You? Tie you down. No. I feel confused now. Cause the cookie dough now? Again, no thank you. I'll have one. Did not offer any to you. Aww. Uh, give this to her? No. Yeah. Yeah, I need to grab him from up there, maybe? See, 
it's telling me to like do something down there. So, turn this candy cloth fountain. Chaos fountain has a good reason to bring. No. 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 I feel like there's something I'm like missing. Okay, nothing here, right? A gnome child does it say okay. You know, Krampus, blah blah blah. Okay. Uh break. No, wait, wait, hold on. What about this? No. This? On the balcony. No. Not on that. Not on that. Talk to him. Talk to that. There's nothing here. Here. Not here. I feel like there's something to do here. Hmm. Am I missing something here, maybe? Spray units. Shovels, shovels, cacti, gnome couples, trowel. Oh, a hammer? Uh, perfect for mildly smashing glass or knocking tin pegs without bending them. Makes for a great camping mallet. She go up against bears and stuff that will let you down. So it's nice to hear Derek's screams. <laughs> Might be handy. Might if I take it? Uh, yes, yeah, sorry for reminiscing there. Okay. I have a hammer now. Mm. Okay. Down. Uh, hit it with this? No. No. Can I hit this? Can I hit this? Can I hit this? <laughs> Can I hit this? Okay. Uh, I'm gonna try everything. Uh, take this. No. Oh, wait, wait. Uh, he says he wants those. Oh, it doesn't work. Put them in here? No. Hmm. Hit the robot? Oh, wait, hold on. Can I go talk to the robot? I just realized. Tell the robot about it. Oh, uh, what do you want, innocent shopper? I need to get to the roof. Access to the security cap, law enforcement officers, but we are police. Look at our badges. Accessing database. Awful motor whirling beep, boop, whoop, dial up noises. Badges not recognized. That makes no sense. Yeah, McKean even asked me our numbers the other day. Double check we're on there. He has sniggering in terms of probably laughing at how unlikely it'd be that we'd not be on there. But look at our current predicament. Oh, wait, I see what happened now. We better find a way to dispatch and get re registered. Uh. Let's have to go back to the car yet. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, shit. I'm, I'm a... Not that. That's not gonna do anything now? I mean, he's up 
there? Like, that doesn't make any sense. Run there for blah blah blah. See why? Here. No. Oh. Okay. Maybe I gotta go back up. It's something stupid. I feel it. No, but whatever. We do all day long. I do know my food. Guys, please don't go about the food. Girls might hear you and get upset. <laughs> Okay. Okay, I grab this stuff from the other pocket. I'm trying to reach the star from there. Oh, he's too far out to reach the Hmm, he's right underneath the sky. Maybe I can grab him up the roof. I gotta use the restroom. I'll be right back. <sighs> Win toys. We went there. Can't do anything here. Can't do anything here. Oop, that's the wrong button. Can't do anything here. You won't let me. Do anything there. <sighs> Nothing there. That doesn't help. That doesn't help. Hit this. Okay, stay back. One delicate tap should do it. Yes. I know I left you for a reason, detective. Better get you home, boy, for your mama finds out what happened. Can I stay up with a Well, since the detective broke that machine, so I must take that stuff. To the authorities. I mean, think you can handle that, girl? Wait till the cops are gone and pack it stuff. Gotcha. <laughs> Smash claw machine. Go me. Nothing left for use here. Watch out for those gifts. Sure thing. Oh my god. You can rob that stuff, aren't you? Honestly, not sure. My it says yes, but the blood wolf in me says yes. Or says maybe only just yes a little. Like 60% 60, 60 yes. What have you done to me? I don't even know who I am anymore. <laughs> oh wait, uh... Are you gonna be okay on your own? Are you serious? I'm blood wolf. I'm ready for anything. That's my girl. Okay, Emily, don't steal that stuff. We both know I'm going to. <laughs> um... I got the claw. This? This. No, okay. Hmm. The only staff member is him. You want? I need to get to the roof. Blah blah blah. Okay, so that's not it. Um. I was gonna say we could use the photos, but that doesn't work. Ugh. Can I do this on you? I just want to adult back only. I need to find a child he hasn't turned yet. Oh, a child he hasn't turned yet. Um, uh, would be her. Hold on. Eh. Can you do a favor and bring some stuff to Santa, please? What's in it for me? The warm feeling and sensation of goodwill? That's not going to rot my teeth. I need them to fall out so I can get cash from the tooth fairy and buy myself a set of metal chompers. Chomp, 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 chomp. Uh, here? Uh, cash. How does I get cash? Okay, no. Uh, not that way. Not that way. 
stuff, but oh, to make a call, please. Guess I'm not using this thing now. You chase off a customer anyway. There we go. Dispatch, Sally, it's McQueen. Can you and me and Julie? Uh, can you add me and Julie back onto the very real police register, please? Sure thing, detective. Thanks. Okay, Julie, let's look at that robot's key. <laughs> yes. What now, human? Try your registry again. Fine. Double checking noise and sounds. Oh, you are on there. Good for you. Can you access the roof now? I guess you can have my access pass. I guess. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. Access pass. Is there anything up there we can use to capture that creature? Bus can be used to sure. But God, a creature's a bit harsh. <laughs> Call us you want to use it. You need to find a replacement. Yes. Okay. Water tank. Water reserve for the sprinkler system. Oh. Okay. That's percent for sitting around like this. Take it all the time. You have no rest to get back indoors. You're freezing, aren't you? I'm so cold. I can't see. <laughs> okay. Let's put this here. Get you back up and running. Can I put this in here? There's no way I'm doing that. This in here. Uh, this in here. This in here. Okay. This in here. Oh, skylight. Right below us is skylight. Oh, so we use it to this contraption. <laughs> Damn it, he's moving too much to grab onto. If I way to stick him into place. Ah, ha, ha. Stick him in place. Oh my god, yes. I see that gnome buzz is stuck up there. Time to go get him. Yes! I hate how simple yet not simple that was. And got him. <laughs> see my inventory now we have. Not to question him and find out what's going on around here. We can interrogate him. You can't be a good cop and I'll be. How is this guy still a cop? <laughs> Let me go. We need to find a way to question this guy. Uh. Eh. No. Uh. Sunny says, gone tomorrow. Like, as soon as we're all up there, she wasn't gonna sell us anything nice anyway. But now, can I. Oh, no. Maybe, uh. Eh. Eh? No. Okay. <laughs> Guess the fountain was stuck like that. Improvement, sure, we all agree. Uh. Eh? <gasps> Wait, get him his toys! Let me just buy that solution. Ah, oh, damn it. Uh. Eh? Let's just hold him in place. Oh, pfft. That's easy. I don't like. Free me. We need to find a way to question this guy. Uh. Uh. Okay. Oh, wait. Uh, here? That's him tied down. Now to question him. Tell me what's going on here. No chance, adult man. Or adult me. No say nothing. Ugh. I need to find somebody to interrogate him with. Do you have your flashlight on you? I sort of traded it. Traded it? Well, last week I was getting my subway to work. He did something to work. I was hungry, and there was this busker with a sandwich, and he really wanted some life so he could find a new home in the tunnels. So one thing led to another. Dually. In my defense, the sandwich is very nice. <laughs> okay, so then lamp on him. Put this down somewhere before I try to use it on him. Uh, on the table? Lamp's in place. Stop, stop! Us tells you all the things. What are you, uh, what are you? Are you Buzz? Is Buzz and isn't. Is Buzz and isn't. You're making no sense. Explain yourself. Krampus, bring out the worst in childer. That's what Gnome is. Badness incarnate. I think Buzz can get much worse. How do we defeat Krampus? What's his weakness? Him lactose intolerable. No like milk. No like milk. Then let's milk him. That's there's a better way to phrase that. And as for you, Mister, you can stay here until you quit whatever it is you quit whatever gang you join. This thing where frozen crabs being allergic to milk. Okay. She wants money. Okay. Take something from a register, or little piece of heart. I don't want a gun. Beep, beep, bang, bang. Oh my God, no.
Okay, wait. So, uh, no. She wants to do this favor. What's in it for me? Uh, I need them to follow so I can cash from the tooth fairy. Oh! She wants. I bet you. No. Go back here. Eh. Time for the goopy. Yes! Goopy candy. Got too close. My shoes are stuck. Guess I'm barefoot from here on out. Get your shoes. Stuck in candy. Five words. Take that him away. <laughs> oh, he really does have no shoes on. Oh my god, yes. Here we go. Candy. Okay, I'll go see stupid claws for you. Yes. Okay, guys, I'm here. Now what? Here you go. Okay, take this to Santa. Sure, I'm loyal to my word. While this tub still holds candy. Got you some treats. Nuh uh, Santa doesn't like milk, only cookies. Drat, better hunt down some cookies to soak in this milk. Ah, go get it from the lady. Eh, 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 eh. It's all falling into place now. I just had to figure out the one thing. Can I trouble you some cookie dough now? Hmm, well, you didn't want my first offered. I say, old girl, this chappy's on a mission. No doubt he needs a slap of your dough to fix the hole breach in some sort. I'll wait or best help him out. Oh, Smithy, you know what I was gonna share. I'm just having giggles with this gentleman, boy. Hey! <laughs> Uh, I need to cook it, right? Let's bake some cookies. Yay! Yes. Any minute now. Any minute. And they're baked. Sure. <laughs> Fresh and bagel. <coughs> <coughs> cookies, kind of dry. Perfect. Oh, she soaked the cookies in milk first. Soak cookies in the milk and give them to Krampus before they turn yeah. to goo. Okay, take these to Santa. Sure, I'm loyal to my world where this tub still holds candy. I got you some treats. Yes, come to my little... Come to me, my little small. Come enjoy my festive hall. Whatever, we're gonna just eat the treats. Mm, okay. I'm gonna wait. Something was up with that food because now I don't feel so good. I mean, it's made a grave mishap. I've fallen into their tasty trap. Oh, no, it's bringing the man to... Big man go floaty way. Ah. <laughs> Krampus is gone, but the children are so trapped as gnomes. Hey, what's up behind the throne? Julia was saying that the children there. Yeah, but look, look, look at the new thing. What mystery it holds? What promise for adventure? But the children, new thing! Fine, but after we look at it, we have to save the children. I agree 100% with whatever it was you just said. Now, new thing, please. There, I did my part. Christmas nil, Emily won. <laughs> Uh, me as diplomatic community, maybe. <laughs> Event, can we talk about saving the kids now? Where do you think it goes? Dooley, come on now, focus. I am focused on the mysterious, wondrous vent. Dooley, what do you think there's a Santa hat in there? <laughs> what? There's a hat, just in the vent there. That big guy floated off with his, so why do you think there's another one there? Do you reckon that's where the real Santa is hidden? I guess I better go find out. Here, hold my coat so I can move around a bit more freely. Boy, it's dark in there. Oh, he's gonna look like the guy from Die Hard. Oh my god. It's cool. You can borrow my lighter. I knew it! Damn it, Julie's right. Santa's hat is in here. Better search around and see what else I can find. Where's Jackie? It must have come this way. Bring me cheese. Do my bidding. I obey! <laughs> What's that? Left boot. His other boot. Must be close now. Trousers. This is supposed to be the right way. I want to say his boots. It must be on the right path. <laughs> Let's put all this together before moving on. There you are. Mm -hmm. What? Mm -hmm. Oh, the gag. Yes, one second. <laughs> There you go. Thank goodness. I said I'd been waiting for you. I knew you'd save the day. Huh? Because I'm Santa Claus. So hand me those clothes and let's get out of here. I have 1.9 billion gifts to deliver and we're running out of time. <laughs> See, long forgotten. No one else to play. Mall is so cold. Okay. Santa's clothes. Thank you. Could you turn around for a moment? Oh, yes, of course. Sorry. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's get out of here. Seems to be luck. Guess we're going out the way I came in. Follow me. 
Fur, I was cold in there. Glad to have my coat back. Oh dear, Krampus left this place. Mass mutated children and general bad vibes everywhere. What can we do to reverse things? Hmm. Here, take this magic Christmas dust. It'll reverse the bad magic. Not much left, so you need to water it down. <laughs> in the freaking sprinkler system. 100%. Okay, this should probably done the dust sound. Trigger sprinklers and soak those monsters. Does this count as a nod to earlier cases or just lazy work? Can it be both? Do it. Here goes nothing. Us kid saves. Let's go tell Santa. Well done. Now I'll have the remainder of Christmas dust back, please. Remainder? Back? I should put you on the naughty list for that, but you used it for a good cause. Thank you both. You haven't been here. This would have been a disaster. Happy to help. Well, I better get going. I have a lot of gifts to deliver and already running late. Good luck out there. It's going to be a cold one tonight. You have the good work. You too, boys. You too. Good job, us. Case closed. I love that. I love that so much. Oh. Oh no, my sleigh! Maybe we spoke too soon. Let's go see what's happening. What's going on here? Well, well, well. If it's not Mick Lame and Officer Fooley, I claim that this man's reindeer for Lordy. He doesn't even have a permit for the city. I have one from the North Pole Licensing Department and a note from the NPPD. I'm not interested in what the NPPD have to say. It isn't their jurisdiction. Why don't I take over for this? Cover the paperwork. No thanks. I'll do it when I get into the office. Then your friend here can go through the appeals process here. Oh, look at the time. She clocked off for the holidays. Guess that paperwork and wait till I'm back. Toodles! What a jerk. How will I deliver all the gifts without my reindeer? Could you hook your sled up to a car and make it fly? Normally, yes, but somebody uses all my Christmas dust, so I'll have no way to power it. Somebody uses all the dust? Who would do such a thing? Oh, yes, never mind. Can we make more dust? Only by finding a kid who doesn't believe in Christmas and changing their mind. We best start looking. Look at all those lights. Each a home. Yeah, lovely, isn't it? All those homes with kids not getting gifts now. We'll fix this, Dooley. Yeah, I, I know we will. Okay, right. That's it. I'm wearing a coat next year. Probably. I'm so embarrassed that we didn't decorate the car now. Yeah, me too. Did you find a child in Blue Christmas? Working on it. <laughs> he did it. He really did it. McKean clamped Christmas. Wow. Don't talk to me. I'm off the clock. Ugh, you're getting fingerprints all over. Your greasy smudge will cause a value of miles per hour up there. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. I gotta go talk to her. Clearly. Oh, wait. Uh, I think I went funny for it there. It must be the poor circulation. How did I end up here? <laughs> could, could somebody give me a hand down? Emily? What? Yes, I wasn't saying debating whether I take a left over gifts or not. Is there still cotton candy in that tub? Yeah, but I'm working on it. Well, if it's still this candy, then you're still my employee. Come with us. Ah, oh, man, I knew I shouldn't stop to rest my teeth and or tummy. Okay, I'm here. Now what? This is Santa Claus. For real. Santa Claus. Hello, Emily. Rubbish. Santa's not real. If I'm not real, then how did I know you sent me a letter? Ah, uh, they made us in school. Anyone would have known that. What did I ask for? This. My blowtorch? No way! Yes way, Emily. Yes way. This cannot be safe. You really are Santa Claus. Look, the car, it's taking off. We should be able to fly now. Simon, hook up the sleigh. Aw, oh, man, I thought I was done for the night. Ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas, everyone. We did it, Detective. We saved Christmas. There's Krampus. <laughs> yeah, and now St. Nick can sort it out with the gifts for tomorrow. Win-win. We didn't forget anything else, did we? <laughs> uh, guys? 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 I love that. Oh my god. Sometimes it literally just takes like some random thing I don't think of. And then I, I can do the rest of the case just fine. Okay. Okay, so I'm dealing with the Dooley family. Poultry guys. Thanks for coming to dinner, detective. My sister loves meeting my colleagues. Dooley, we've been coming to dinner at your sister's once a month for years. And she loves it. Let's get inside where my tummy revolts. Aw, look at this friendless chap. No Malone, hey. We bought him from a friend, but he lost in New York. Oh, no. Why is there no sound out of these? They broke last summer, so I glued them back together. Glued them up real good. Patricia's gonna be so happy that you made it. It always means to me that your sister is called Patricia. 
Why? What, really? You didn't think it's odd that you're called Patrick and she's called Patricia? Nope, it's a good name. And also, sister Patrice agrees and so does my brother. Also Patrice. Also Patrice? How else will we tell him apart from normal Patrice? <laughs> Did you take the squad car? Did you take the squad car over? I was running late. Sirens are a hungry boy's best friend. Oh my god. Oh. Okay. What the? What's going on here? Yeah, but I was trying to see you off your plane. Your joy child. Tristy doesn't grow on trees. No, Dooley, the TV. What? I just told him. It's alive. Yes, alive and angry. <laughs> the things kids watch these days, huh? Interesting piece. Mom painted it. It's called I Have No Mouth and I Must Scream. What the? Save me. What? Are you trapped in there? Who are you? Oh, I'm just yanking your chain. I don't need saving, but the people in this house do. What are you? I'm a poultry guy. It's a professional haunter of places with preference towards possessing and or moving things. And this house is my new home. Why are you here? A team of game developers trapped me in this VHS tape. I don't know why, but these fools freed me. I'm never going back. I want revenge for being trapped like that. Not a really dehumanizing experience, but you're not human. I don't care. I just wanted an excuse to cause trouble. Where have you hidden the remote control? Far away from here and far away from you, fleshy. Why is nothing ever easy? What do you want? Mayhem. I'm slowly taking control of this house, and once I do, I'm going to trust everything and everyone in it. I better get everyone out of here, Dooley. Ah, the door's locked. <laughs> tick tock, tick tock. I'm going to crush everyone who lives in this block. We need to find a way to exercise this TV and fast. How polite for a soon to be flat and flesh bag. Not on my watch, creep. Whatever sis cooking smells great, you can call me Officer Truly. Ugh, what? Hey, Buzz. Ugh, you made me lose my high score. I hate you. Kid is just magic creatures, eh, Detective? What's going on here? Nothing. Buzz, tell your unky detective what happened. Ugh, fine. I'll merge the video to watch after dinner, but I was bored and I put it on, then the TV flipped out, so I played my game. Where did you rent this video from? Indian Battleground Video Rentals Incorporated. Ugh. Where's the tape now? I don't know. Still in the machine, I guess. Did you try to eject it? Why would I do that? God! Other than there being a thing on your TV? Leave me alone. You're ruining my game. Whatever. You ruin your appetite with that stuff, Buzz. All the more dinner for you to eat, then. We need to get this kid more snacks. Stacked! <laughs> Let's see. The workout horror flick, The Exorcist. The story about some vampires realizing the air of the ways. The Found Boys. This incredibly tame fantasy adventure classic, No Trouble in Little Italy. Wait, these aren't books, they're hidden safe, but there's nothing inside of it. Wouldn't leave anything worth in a place like that. There's a lot of books thieves around this area. I may steal your valuables by mistake and then everyone would be upset. Daisies are my favorite type of flower. Mine's wholemeal. The girl needs is fiber. That's vile. Let's just unplug it. I don't think so. Zap, zap. Ow. Ah, take that. What if I just eject the tape? Nuh-uh, kazap. Ah, it's my fingers. Need some other way to remove it. Eh, good luck, flesh bag. <laughs> Okay. Glad you boys can make it. Thanks for inviting us, Patricia. I wore my Spanish uniform so I have room for seconds. Confiscating these for later? Good plan. <laughs> Don't eat too much. Dinner will be ready soon. I won't. I just need to borrow these sausages. Can I taste? Can I? Can I? Patrick Julie, learn some patience. If I want patience, I become a doctor, brat. Popular tarts. The breakfast treat of choice for promiscuous children. Okay, same thing. Serial killers. Bought them while they're young. Baked beans pizza because the little people in your life are disgusting. <laughs> I can never foresee a situation where I want to carry a pot around in my jacket. Any some help taking out the washing? Always, but it's useless when it comes to chores. Thank you, Francis. Hi, Francis. Hope you brought your appetite with you. I did. Thanks for having me. My pleasure, Francis. You know I love when you visit. Dinner smells good. Fry it up with some onion and garlic, and anything will smell good. Ha, I'm sure it will be lovely. Be better than a steady diet of coffee and donuts, anyway. Girl goes chasing our hard after things. May I have some? Sure, here's some leftovers. It'll leave your hands smelling divine. Yeah. Hi, Francis. I've great appetite with you. Pretty sure if you noticed anything unusual since Buzz tried out that tape. He watched it already? That boy. So exhausting. Sorry, Francis. We ran out of the place getting dinner ready, so I don't think I've noticed even if the walls were closing in around me. Talk soon. Ah, Spooky doorway. So what's going on here? Buzz must have left the pantry light on. He's never leaving the lights on. Do you think electricity grows on trees? That's not a saying. <laughs> Uh, did your sister get the extension built onto the house? Oh, little, um, little buzz thing? Unlikely. I wish I could stop sign. I wish I could. There's a remote. I just need a way to safely get to it. Got a pretty judgy expression for a rubber duck trapped outside of time and space. Why is there no actual food in this pantry? <laughs> uh, sheet? Reach by itself. Sheet on you? Uh, eh? Oh, eh, eh? 
the day to day. It only makes me want too greasy to pick up. I need something less greasy to use with this. Eh, eh. <laughs> okay, Julie, hold on to this as tightly as you can. I will never let go, Jack. I oh, don't say that. She did let go. She held on to the promise. Hey, let's discuss this over dinner. Right now, it's time to grab this remote. Fine. Okay, so we need batteries. Uh, your pantry. Have you noticed anything dimensional about it? Well, there has been some draft coming for it today. Is that what you mean? Uh, sure. I'll see if I can fix that. That'd be fantastic. We're trying to get too dirty. Dinner will be ready soon. Oh my gosh. Careful now. It's piping hot. Oh. Just want to make sure. Uh, eh. Eh, eh. Eh, eh. Want some chocolate? Yes. I'll trade you for the batteries in your joy child. No way! Okay, more delicious chocolate for Dooley and me. Hooray! Fine, I'll trade. Aww. Put the batteries in here. Da, da. Get them away from me. You received evil VHS. Hopefully we can stink the evil out of this tape. There you go. I need to cook the garlic juices into the tape. Give me back my tape, you monster. You want to crush us all and I'm the monster? This won't stop me, you know. I'm still going to squish you all. Only now I'll make it slow. Hmm, maybe I can do something to tape to help you get rid of that thing. Just put this in here for a moment so the garlic juice will melt and cleanse the cassette. And it's ready. Cleanse VHS. So now we put it in here. Yeah, give me that. Wait, this doesn't taste right. Blah. Damn you. Bacon, cabbage, and potato. My favorite. Eat up, everyone. I hope my three best boys ready for whatever the world throws at them. Thanks, Patricia. No need to thank me. We're all family here. Ugh, grown-ups are so lame. Oh, my God. That was so quick. Cute. Okay, last one. Uh, it's Julie's birthday, so I'm taking her to Twin Lakes' number one roadside attraction to celebrate. At the Bates Motel. Excited? Boy, Emma, it's such a neat way to spend my birthday. I can't believe Chief Scully gave us time off work. I have a lot more sway of the Chief than you might think. You didn't tell her, did you? No, but perk of the job, I told her El Chupacabra was causing trouble out here. Is that a gang? Point is, we're not expected back at the office for a few days. Let's get in there and kick back. Aww. Can't believe it's taking so long for it to come to Twin Lakes Finest Rose Night Attraction. The finest and only attraction. I'm excited to see what sort of stuff has been fished up from Lake Monster and stored here. But I'm excited to find out why they're taking all the way out here to the desert and not storage near the lake itself. Anyway, let's grab our bags from the car and throw out the room at the reception before we go visit the museum. The Bates Motel. So much neon. It's so you can't see how crummy this place is. Ah, Nowhere my best buddy brings me for my birthday could be crummy. Ah, Can't believe we're able to get in such exclusive establishment. I think you may want to rein in those expectations, buddy. I have us booked in. Don't want to risk there being no rooms left at the inn. The inn is a motel detective. Trash can full of old burrito wrappers and half full energy drink cans. That's a potent drink. It lets you see sounds and hear your own heartbeat box. Hope I never have to drink that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> oh, my God. We should drop our bags off at our room first. If I drop them here, I can see the attraction right away. Dooley, why'd you bring a lamp? We're only here for the night, so I figured it packed light. Just that and some power supplements in case we want to work out while we're here. I love you, buddy, but don't ever change. <laughs> Try not to. That's why I wear a uniform on holidays. I'm so glad this place is the aircon. It's so warm out here in the desert. Eh, stop taking all the cool air. Your room has your own cool air. Go breathe in there. You're raising temperature level in here. Eh, caught that fish myself. You ain't never caught one that big, have you? No, that's for sure. A desert. A one-stop destination for all your poorly conceived spiritual journeys. Hey, that water's not for drinking. Really? What do I look like, a unicorn to you? Of course, really. It's my water. You want water? You have to go to the diner next door. That ain't for customer's use. It's for when I want to fax my mother. Make sure she fed the cat. She never remembers to feed the damn cat. Every night I come home to her screaming at her. And her screaming at it. Just feed the damn cat, ma. Why are you using a fax machine for that? I don't want to talk to her. I don't want to talk to you either. What are you watching? Name your business, that's what. I love it. Did you know the first reception was built in Ohio by Julius Caesar in 1932 BC? Or 19, 932 BC? What history books are you reading? Wait, you can read about history? 
Oh my gosh. Eh, who's the freaking door? You landed all the sand in. Why are you here anyway? We're here for the attraction. And you're in the wrong place, moron. This is a hotel. You should have been able to see the motel for sign out front. Not so good at the detective being for a detective, huh? Traction is back on the main road, then follow the sign. You know you're near the account of localized sandstorm. Localized sandstorm? That's what I said, ain't it? Now you got the smart guy. You can handle all that. I have a room booked here. So you're the guys. I was wondering if you're going to turn up. It's late. You're late. You're in room two. Thanks. Don't thank me. I didn't clean the place out after the last guess. <laughs> yeah, wise guys. Where is it you think you're going? In there is for golden ticket holders. Do you have a golden ticket? No, thought not. <laughs> Oh my god. So you don't have to see anything inside. Not us, we're one over. Do vending machines do birthday cake? Would you really want cake from a vending machine? Would you not? Hold on, does he say anything out here? You think of, I have a head for hats? I was thinking you should wear hats more often. Truly, you're always wearing a hat. You're a police hat. Sure, but I have to wear this for work. I was thinking of a stylish hat. Oh, for off duty? Huh? No, to wear over this one. On duty is when I meet the most new people, so I want to try it my best, you know. It's full of out of date shampoo and toothpaste. All the food items are gone. It doesn't look like this is that well maintained. Much like all non military services in this country. Oh, look, there's a bag of cheese puffs in the slot. Might as well take it. These things never go off. Hell yeah. Leave me alone. <laughs> Three whole rooms. This is the biggest motel I've ever been to. The curtains are pulled over. I can't see inside. Not us. We're one over. Oh, swimming pool. Okay, well, let's go put our stuff down, I guess. This is us. Let's unlock it and go in. Here we are. Finally, I feel like we've been walking forever and seeing nothing. Okay, this is us. Let's dump our bags. I've seen this before. It's the AI that controls the ship. Hello? Are you there? They must have let this battery run down. Good. I don't want to watch you while I sleep. Thank goodness there's aircon. Desert heat would have been stifling otherwise. I don't think I can stay indoors without it. Seems a good place to put our bags. Okay, that's a settle down. Should we go see the attraction now? Yes, finally. You're right, Detective. It was a good place to put the bags. No expense spare for this room, eh? Sorry, Julie. It's all I could afford. Huh? No, I'm serious. I love it. Thanks, Detective. Aw, oh, I'm glad. We have a half a phone. But is the phone half empty or half full? One of those 50 cent vibrating finger beds. Hello, gorgeous. Not connected to anything. Guess we're sleeping with the lights on. <laughs> oh my god. I want to see the swimming pool. Oh. Brings back old memories. What are you doing out here at this hour? Sunbathing. It's nighttime. I don't want to get sunburned. Daytime is when the rays are out hunting. <laughs> Bucket of highly chlorinated water from the pool. You want to watch that stuff. They say it's good for your teeth, but really, it's so the sheep will don't rise up against the government. Dually, you're thinking of fluoride, which is not used for mind control. Also, you shouldn't be putting chlorine anywhere near your mouth. It's toxic. Oh, that might explain the horrible taste in my mouth each morning. Are you going to clean that donut crumbs out of the car finally? Dually, you left those crumbs there. Is that a no then? <laughs> Circuit breaker for the motel. It's like a witch's broom for the damper kind of witch. Must be where the motel heats this water and ruins full too, I guess. I'm glad I got to see this. Missed out on the last boiler room. It's a beauty, all right. I'm glad it brought trunks. I'm glad I like skinny dipping. <laughs> so let's look at that water. Chemical blue is the name, I think. Okay. Base motel. Shame signs is the fanciest part of this place. Carmel's coming to Twin Lakes. What are they doing at this dump? I mean, thanks for the thoughtful birthday trip. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Ah, I didn't think much of a walk. It'd be good for us. Hmm, I wonder what that haze in the distance is. What's going on here? I think it's part of the attraction? I don't, Julia. I don't. It's a sandstorm. Why is it centered on the attraction? Does this mean? Yes, Julia. A case to investigate. Say it isn't so. Hold on. I just could block the wind causing that sandstorm. Nothing like the dry spring desert air. You can really feel the sand in your nostrils. We block the sandstorm with this. Okay. Can we get in it? Oh, I guess not. I guess we have to get a, a key for it. Everybody seems to close down because of the storm. Sandstorm center on the attraction entrance. If you want to get inside the investigation, we need to find a way to block it. Okay, get in a wall, blah, blah, blah. There's a sandstorm center on the attraction's entrance. If you want to get inside, blah, blah, blah. Okay. 
The storm looked nice to him. I can't see with all the sand in my eyes. Okay, so where's the key? Truck, billboard, truck. Parking lot? You had to go over? Frick door laying all sand in. Uh, where can I get the keys to that truck out front? Does this place look like a carnival? Sorry? I asked you, does this place look like a carnival? No. Then why do you think I own a carnival advertising truck? You're blowing some other poor schmuck staying here. What was the room number two? It was two. It's not that hard to remember. Two. Now get. <laughs> okay. Let's try three. Not us. I guess we could talk to him. Do we not hear somebody? Blah, blah, blah. Okay. So maybe it was one. thirsty right now? What about you? Do I have to? So I spent a vacation. Okay. The diner. Boy meets girl. <laughs> an age old love story. I can't believe we were able to get into such an exclusive establishment. I think you may want to rein in those expectations, buddy. <laughs> Sign and paint it on. I guess they're open 24 7. Those are my kind of opening hours. Oh, behind the diner. It's behind the diner. Hey there, little. Well, fast one, aren't you? Imagine a witch jumped out from behind this bin and we both had a heart attacks and died. Right, no more scary movies for you for bed. Aww, how about this? Let's give a cheesy puff to the rat. They'll be down treats, but not up a rat. The vent into the kitchen. Standard diner waste. A bandit car. Also, there's a discarded cross wrench in the truck. I my wrench is happy. Let's take it and cheer it up. <laughs> That's abandoned and empty car. Okay. Welcome, boys. Can I fix you up a little something to eat? Ooh, sorry. Reading just makes me yawn constantly. Anyway, are you the boss here? Sure, I surely am. Though it's only me and Klaus, and we're closed off, uh, and we're closed off season, so it's not that fancy a setup. Keeps my lights on and his workshop running. So wait, forget I say anything. Are you linked to the motel? Gracious, no. I don't think Narvin would want. <laughs> to work with others. He's not what you call a people person. Is Narvin in a public facing job? The way I heard it, family business. His mom fished so his pa ran the place. He got stuck with it for some reason or another. I think he likes the power. I think he wanted to get his hands on a real abuse of authority and become police, but it didn't work out. Hey, they gave me a shrug animation. This is when I'd use it. <laughs> Y'all come back now, you hear? Mustard and ketchup. The two genders. <laughs> Can we stop what we're doing and order one of everything, please? It's like a processed torpedo coming right from my heart. Order whatever you want, boys. Yes. But remember, the cook only really knows how to bake cookies. Aw, oh, wait, what? <laughs> I hope the burgers in here are as good as they look. Are they ever? Not in Twin Lakes, honey. The mayor ruled all food has to be worse than advertised. Keep the population dissatisfied. All right, shoppers. Shoppers? It's a rhyming slang for coppers. Is it? I don't know. I'm trying to butter churn it. Learn it. <laughs> right, doesn't sound like it's going all that well. No. What brings you out here? Trying to promote our road show, Lady Farnival's Rivulous Carnivals. Wait, that's that slang or that's what it's called? I don't know anymore. <laughs> Is that your truck out front? My what? Your truck? Your um, rubber duck? Oh yeah, my rubber duck's parked out in the Encipherable Code. Encipherable Code. Road? Yep. Can I borrow the uh, bee's knees? Oh, if you want the bee's knees and you want something in return, uh, let me think. A garden hermit? One well, essential to set up your circus clown. Okay, sure. Sorry, what? If you want my truck keys and a permit 
So my carnival can set up in your town, mate. Oh, I understood that time. Right, off I go to phone the precinct. <laughs> See you later, perspective. Ooh, kitchen. Oh, well, I wouldn't do have a kitchen like this at home. Jar of maple syrup. Now I just need a stack of pancakes. This cork wells makes you glue. Not a chance. I know, you, I know what you're like, young for, young fella, because I've never met you before. Uh, don't you know that outside the American people call this jelly? They call it jam. And jelly is what we call jello. And here jam means suck. But also it means suck as well as jelly. Language is zany. Yeah, I'd hate to be a non-American trying to capture even a loose glimpse of their culture. Well, as us Americans are always saying, when in Rome, Monday morning quarterback. <laughs> I cannot agree more. I guess a place like this can never have too many sauces. Some yeast for making burger buns and other stuff rise and expand. My desire for burgers is rising and expanding as we stand here. Maybe I should ho ho hold it there. Can't just take my yeast. I need it for making Christmassy and uh, uh, other more year-long types of cakes. Seems to be broken. Hope no critters get in here. Me too. We have to close that away for a fumigation if they did. A shiny food blender for sauces and shakes. And seasonal items such as eggnog. Just an example. I think we should check for clues. Some weighing scales. They don't look used. I'm an artist. Gotta guess the amounts. And the elves help. I mean, Merry Cookmas! Aw, oh, trat. It's full of Christmas cookies. It's my signature dish. Hey, I know you. You're Santa Claus. Uh, no, I'm not. Somebody else. Yes, somebody else entirely. What are you doing here? I'm just a guy with bills to pay. Just like you. Heating bills, am I right? Maybe. <laughs> Goodbye. His ingredients, whatever they might be. Eh? Do I have to? Eh? 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 Eh. Okay, I just want to see. Eh? No, okay. Okay. We'll go back to the thing. Go in here, and here. Here for customer use. It's for when I want to fax my mother. Okay, blah, blah, blah. I need a police business. Well, fine, but you got 30 seconds, I swear. Dispatch. Sally's me. I need a... Who's me? Sally, Detective McQueen. We work together. We're friends. Well, if we're such good friends, how can we ask how it was first? Right to business. I could go to business for two, you know. I'm sorry, Sally. It was rude to me. How are you? Busy. Too busy for our chatter. What's up? Can you ask the chief to sign a permit so the car can come to Twin Lakes? No, do you have pre-signed permits here? Consider it done. Why do you have pre-signed permits just sitting around? Look, do you want the permit or do you want to ask questions? Permit, please. I'll fax it to you. <laughs> Don't need to use the game besides I want to anger the owner again. Damn right you don't keep your mitts to yourself. Oh my god. Permit. I have your permit. Sorry, your what was it? Your something hermit? Oh, that's a week long cruise. Good news. Here are my rubber duck bees and these truck keys. I appreciate it, but I have to ask, why are you trying to talk like that? Sounds like a lot of hassle. It adds an air of authenticity, doesn't it? Does it though? <laughs> Truck keys. Hop and do this. Go block that sandstorm. Okay, the truck has blocked enough of the storm to get us near the entrance. This is exciting. These people are struggling to get out of museums. Welcome to Trout of This World, Twin Lakes Twin Lake Finding Museum. Hello again. Hello again to you too. Long time no see. You don't remember us, do you? I'm afraid that's where you have caught me out. Please forgive me. My job as tourism officer at Twin Lakes to meet literally tens of people a year. I try, though I do. I cannot remember them all. What was this? What's that storm about? You know, I often wonder the same thing about storms and blizzards. Heat waves, too. What's it about? What is it all about? But what's about this one? Ah, Jamie, this one. This one will come and they will ask you about it, I told myself. Sadly, I had stepped out to the bathroom. All I know is that a fisherman came to see the place and by the time the storm came, he was gone. What do you look like? Yellow hair and a moustache, and a fisherman clothes, as in clothes that smell like fish. Can you tell us about this place? Well, despite numerous warnings, many people go to the lake monster to fish. Of course, the very real lake monster has almost certainly eaten all the fish. With probably no fish to catch, people dredge up old boats, license plates, terrible artifacts of power that reverse bicycles. In case they're of value, Mayor wants them to all be cataloged, and in case they belong to the terrible lake fiend, I, as a head of tourism, store them as far from the lake as I can. When something is found, I drive over here. Wait, reverse bicycles? Yes, the frame is made of flattened rubber, and the wheels are made of metal. Local inventor Claudia Rott invented them to reduce bike congestion across the city. Do you have any merchandise? Oh yes, we sell boots modeled on 
boots found in the lake. They're very uncomfortable. We also have t-shirts soaked in lake water to give them a unique pungent smell. And hats with their own logo on them. Ah, hat. I want a hat. One hat for the birthday boy, please. Coming right up. When you step with a logo on it. I bet we have built-in miniature versions of our logo on top. Yes, I love it. Okay, let's dig our way in. So far, I'm digging this case. Look at it all. The finest things fish in the bottom of the lake monster. A bowling ball, a teddy bear. Oh, look, an knocked over lamp. Speaks for itself, really. Yeah, there are no cameras on display here. Stay strong, guys. Someone will fish one up one day. Wait, how did I get here? Was I fished out of the lake? Of course not, Dooley. Ha! I had you go in there for a second thinking I was fished out of the lake. You did, didn't you? But seriously, I wasn't right. What kind of bait do you think they used to catch this? Oh, wow, a photo of Bigfoot. That's a picture I took. Wait, you met Bigfoot? It's... Can you introduce me? Sure. It says the Holy Grail. Genuine article. Number 3,423 from limited run of 5,000. Genuine indeed. Wow, a two-headed fish. Hmm, I can see the sketch lines. The stitch lines. A two-headed fish that can stitch? Even more impressive. Hey, this looks like that camp counselor I met. That was Nigel. In a disguise. Oh yeah, boy is it convincing. A strange looking lamp with the lid removed. The genie's not in right now. Please leave your wish at them to be. I wish I didn't have to go back to work after this trip. I wonder if this is a real genie's lamp. And if so, where's the genie? A straight magic might explain the sandstorm outside. We should look around. Something that powerful could cause a lot of trouble. We better have a look around for it. This claims to be Excalibur. Give me a look. Huh, I can't get it out. An ominous custom plate. Can't swim. <laughs> a bird skeleton. Reminds me of the time I picked museum locks with one of these. This guy is starting to make me nervous. <laughs> Look at all this stuff. I don't think you're meant to take photos. It says so right there on the sign. What are you, the police? Yes, actually. Oh, I just thought your son was just up for Halloween. We're the same age and it's the wrong time of year. Yeah, I guess I'm sorry. Don't be. I'm very flattered. Oh, my God. Is there more? Is that it? Seems to be a better place to promote a carnival. Two birds, one stone, all that. No one looking. Items building your other attendees. That just displayed items. Zillow and Capers and Investigations. No lake monsters. <laughs> nope. That's all I meant to do. Okay. Oh. These lights exist with that low flying planes and UFOs and crashing into towers. Why do I always find myself so high up? Let's see where the motel gets the TV signal. Oh my god. Ooh. The detective, he's waving. A hill made of ants. Close, buddy. Close. Ruff, ruff. It's like a football. Just don't kick it. For once, I'm glad to see you, Moon. It'd be very dark if you were here. Uh, if we were out here on our own. What a beautiful night. You never really see the moon in the city. Julie, we see it all the time, most nights. Oh, I never really look up in the city on account of not being able to see anything when I do. <laughs> Can I do this here? No. Can I do this here? I'm not sure it's going to achieve anything. I give it to you. No. Okay. So I need to mess the signal up so I can go up to the thing, right? Hmm. Not that, not that. I guess we could just go back to our room. Her luggage. I can't believe you brought was protein supplements. Really? Are you sure you can't believe it? Actually, yeah, I can't believe it. Want some? I got enough to share. Fine. Yay! Uh, eh? Eh, eh, eh. Fizzing and hissing can be excited to drink this later on. Super shake. Eh? Eh? Oh, hey! Look at the jawline on this fella. You, you're gorgeous, debonair, suave. I was gonna say blue. 
Not shallow, I don't know the color of my skin. No, I just, it's not so common around here. Where I'm from, everyone is blue. Pink faces like you would be odd, but I have the decency not to make a thing of it. I'm sorry. So you're the missing genie. Ah, yes, I was my own business drying out some soap delicates from my lamp, skinny dip in your lake, when well, this man gives me unsolicited rubbing. Now I'm stuck with him until he makes three wishes. Usual fare, no extra wishes, nuclear wars off the table, no naughty stuff. I thought I escaped this life, but I'm stuck with who with him until he's wished out, then whoever finds me next gets a go. Wish I knew a way to break the cycle and get home to my family. People running around the state with wishes seems dangerous. Maybe we can get this genie home, and maybe we can get him home while we were at it. I just said that. Good, because you know, it seems like you're getting wishes off the streets of uh, Twin Lakes would be a good thing. I'm surprised you're so against it. Duly, I'm not against it. I suggested it. Okay, okay, I won't force your arm. I just think it'd be safer for the city if we helped. It's nice to get them home. Where are you from? I'm from the dreams of ancient men, a place of incompatible... Incompar Compatible lights and sights. You don't know, do you? Nah, I left when I was a kid. How would you get home? I don't know. I've never gotten back. All I know is that I have to be free of this guy's wishes first. Sorry that I can't give you better guidance, but wishes are my realm. For guidance, you need something like a spirit quest. A spirit quest? Yeah, a high intensity journey into the wilderness. High intensity? Like, high energy. People usually mix up a power of caution to help them get into the right mindset. I don't know much more to be honest. It's not my kind of thing. Maybe somebody wise can guide you. Wise, huh? Fine, I'll do what I can. I'm not promising anything. If you need to ask me anything else, you know where to find me. Beside whatever master goes. Guten Abend, mein Freund. Uh, good evening. Hello, friend. What a glorious evening. As a child, I'd sit out on evenings like this and think. And think what? I just think, you know, thoughts. Who's your friend? This is my good luck charm. My ace in the hole. My third phase, meaning they're good for me to have. With them, I'll surely find the best piece of lake junk that has ever been found. Then I'll be on the cover of Lake Junk Monthly. That will undoubtedly lead to a dazzling array of talk show panels and book signings. Not my books, of course. And I've not written one, just to sign random books. After that, what could life possibly hold for me? I'll grow jaded and weary and travel the world looking for the next big lake to fish in, the next piece of junk to find, always hoping to relive plastic glories. In the end, my mana will overshadow the original find and become solely what I've known for, or so I can hope. <laughs> what brings you to the desert? Well, I'll tell you a story, shall I? I came here to fish something up from your lake and put it in a museum here. Is that the end of your story? Yes, didn't you like it? It was certainly to the point. Where are some resin likes and dislikes? For no reason, none at all. I don't like being hungry or being too warm, and I'm allergic to ants. They make me itchy. On the other hand, I enjoy uh, forcing mystical beings to help me fish junk into a better standard than I would otherwise achieve. This has been a good conversation. Thanks for having it. <laughs> Off we to sing. Can I... Eh? Right in front of them. Yes! Okay, cool. Had to coordinate water. Uh, eh? Huh. Eh. You gotta clean No. I just can't just take it? Can I open this? And we're in. Aha! I don't know what I want to turn off here. Not fair. They're fresh. I don't want to break them. Okay, fair. Um, no. Excuse me. Can I ask about... Eh, we just finished our transactions here. I have no more help to give you. Capiche? Hmm. Uh, I can break into the store. What is that you think you're doing there? Nothing? Yeah, keep it that way. Hmm. Can I go... Here, close, buddy, close. Here, goodbye. Normal blood pressure. What in the hell? Where did that come from? What do you mean? That's been there all along. No, wait. Is this how you see the world all the time? Finally, you're here. We thought you weren't going to make it in time. In time? Yes, you're scheduled for 15 minutes ago. You're lucky we had the cancellation. We're not been able to fit you in tonight. It sounds like you run a pretty tight ship. Oh, we have to. The desert is littered with people trying to find themselves these days. You ask me, I think unchecked capitalism has left us in a place where people's identity is based on what value they provide. But, er... Is based on what value they provide, but advancing technologies leave many of them with nothing to offer. Anyway, shall I get started? Should we get on the temple then? I just want to see if you said anything else about anything. Guess we're going to the ominous pyramid in the middle of the desert. There's nothing I want to do more. Wait, how do we get back from here? We don't, I guess. 
Welcome, travelers. The answer you seek lies within. Answers? Oh, right. Let's try that again, shall we? Welcome, travelers. The an questions you seek lie within. Then also within are the answers that you'll seek as follow-up to the aforementioned questions. This is all very confusing. Well, it's a spirit quest. If I just told you what was happening, it'd be a bit more of a spirit consultation, really. Anyway, try to carefully, brave journeyman. In we go, I guess. The age-old ritual of energy on my door, which we both know better. Oh, wait. Hold on. I didn't ask him what he thought. Uh, weren't we just here? Ah. Must have been the cheap scene to make. <laughs> I don't like this. Do we live here now? The hotel tells us. It's simple, please. Watering the halls do not punishment to those who anger the main door god. Finally. Look at this place. The temple to the body. I'm with my people. Duly, they're wolves. Shut it, two legs. I'm a wolf now. Oh, 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 oh. Duly, you're not a wolf. Gruff, ruff. Oh my god. You want to stay clear of that, brother? The balance is off. Colorblind, bison messed it up and ran away. I'm burning so much energy I can smell my fur singe. Awoo! Excuse me? Less talking, more pumping. Who are you? I'm the baddest, maddest, raddest wolf in the desert. Rockin' Rick Rover, they call me, but you can call me Rockin' Rick Rover, just like everyone else. Uh, why are you wearing sunglasses at night? Only thing rather than pumping iron is looking cool while pumping iron. What are you doing here? Where else would I be? The motel? Lame. The diner? Lame. The attraction? Lame. If Rick can't pump, then it's a dump. Oh, sorry. Oh. <laughs> Smell you later, smooth face. Brother, you can do it. Crush that iron. Uh, hi? Hey there, brother. You here to bench? I guess I am. That's a shame, brother. The bench is bust. Miss that bench, brother. I'm Randy, brother. Stronger than any hound around. Want an arm wrestle? Uh, no, think so. That's because you know I'll win, brother. No shame at it. I'm the better wolf. In fairness, you are a better wolf than I am. Yeah, brother. Where is this place? This here is a desert gym, brother, where wolves, coyotes, and bison come to work out and unwind. The rest is those freeloaders that haven't come back since Argus broke the lifting bench. Broke it? Yeah, brother. You put the blue weights on the red side and the reds on the blue. The balance is out of whack. Want me to see if I can fix it for you? Hell yeah, brother. I tried, but I'm a wolf. No opposable thumbs. Must be too busy shredding these weights. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Uh, what are you doing here? Working on these fisty piz pistons. Do you do anything else? Brother, if this world offers something other than working on oneself, I do not want to know. <laughs> see you around, brother. Okay, let's see if we can put this bench working for these guys. You need to move the weights across the other side. They're heavy, so I can only move them one step at a time. I can't move them backwards, but I can start again if I need to. Oh. Alright, messed it up. Shit. Okay, hold on. No, fuck. I did it again. Damn it. Okay, hold on. I keep like almost getting it too.
be one and the other. There we go. The bitch is fixed, guys. Great work, brother. I knew if I put your mind to it, you'd get there in the end. Great. I'm still uh, not entirely sure why I'm actually here. Oh, I forgot, brother. I meant to show you the next part of the journey. Oh, whoops. My brother, hold on tight. Detective, I don't feel so good. Oh. <laughs> he gets to keep his little hat. Extra dimensional. But what just happened? Did you see all that, Dooley? What, the gym rules and the space baby stuff? So it did happen? Of course, we literally just did it. You're not weirded out by all that. Why would I be? It seemed like perfectly normal smoke and mirror secret advert to me. Right, so what do we do? I think it was pretty clear. If you want to help the genie get home, we need to stamp that lamp with some special space stamps. We're all find stamps like that out here in the desert. Wait, what's this in my pocket? <laughs> How'd they get here? Might be best not to think about that too much. That's how I get through these cases. Hm, agreed. But what are they for? Weren't you paying attention? But these can get the genie posted home once he's wish free. And with all that meant, I, right? I guess we're going to stamp the genie's lamp, I guess. Ha, you're a poet. You didn't even know. Know it, Dooley. Know it. Know what? Never mind. Let's go. I think not. It seems to be occupied. Um, are we sure we don't want to do this? No. Okay. So let's go to the attraction. Let's go in here. Let's stamp the lamp. What are you doing? Putting a stamp on the lamp. Yeah, but you're using the blue ones. You need to use the red ones. Al was clear about the postage stamp required. Was it? Okay, is this better? Much. Super. Now let's go waste some wishes. It's stamped and ready to go. Now for phase two. Getting the genie back into it. We need to get Otto to waste the wishes on harmless stuff. Let's get to it. Maybe ship. Now it's time to get the wishes cast. Okay. Nothing in there anymore. Oh, up here? Um, no, okay. Mm. Oh, now let's go. Oh. So they auto drop something. Golden ticket. Oh, to the thing. I think I should bring it to the room right in front. They're not right here. Oh, they're inside watching TV. I can get him to waste a wish if they're hungry, but there's no kitchen to feed them. Ah, uh, okay, hold on. That's no way to spend a vacation. Basket, where do you think you're going? And there's for golden ticket holders. Do you have a golden ticket? No, thought not. I do have a golden ticket. What's this? Oh, you think you're a big shot now? Well, you're gonna go take it, you is. In you go, your majesties. This is exciting. God damn it, Narvin. <laughs> Guys, if we don't use it, I can hang him a coat up in the room. Either way, it'll get used. Hey, I have my dirty clothes in the dark, too. <laughs> well, I guess we're trapped in the case now. Wailing whites. Leave your sheets white enough for even the pickiest haunting. If I have to wash anything, then this will not feel like a holiday. As a kid, I used to love these giant bubble machines. The right mix of detergent and kitchen supplies always covered the place with suds. Now my sister makes me use a laundromat. I guess this is a lot of relaxing at the museum slash poolside. I'm sorry, buddy. How come these things are always seem to eat one sock? I'm not sure. That may be a case for a quiet week. Okay. I think that's it. Could I put this in here? No. No, oh, I want to turn off here. No. This. No. Hmm. Uh, put this in this. Put this in this. This in here. Um. Okay. Uh, eh? No. 
go to the diner. I have tasty cheese bits for you. Hand them over then. Duly there for the rat. Can I have them addressed like a rat? Okay, put it in here. Okay, I'm gonna shut this place down. Wait, can I have to do a police thing too close to it? Too late. <laughs> What's this, little rat friend? Well, ho ho holy, oh little guy. Oh wait, you shouldn't be in here. Hey Sue, why did you have this rat in the kitchen again? Rat? Damn it, sugar. I told you before, every time you see a rat, I got a sh uh, shut up shop for the day. Oh, uh, okay, guess we're clocking off early then. Damn it. <laughs> what is the kitchen? Um, is this snow? Eh? No. Eh. And your diner waste. Should really get the elves to fix that bin. Uh, I mean, I should fix it myself. Hope this closure doesn't cost you too much. Oh, you're a goodie for it, but I'm a millionaire. I only do this for funsies. Nikki, you mind me finishing that off? <laughs> Perfect for carrying meals, hitting muggers on the head, and impromptu games of frisbee. Wait, those don't look used. Thank you, yeah, I love these burgers on. Uh, let me check for clues. Make sure the city gives you accommodation for your work here. Of course, you can bring your family to the ceremony. We'd be thrilled to meet them. Um, eh? Eh. Not that. Ah, grabbing it, yes. Okay, we just had to grab the stuff while he wasn't in here. Eh? Eh. Eh, eh? Okay. Oh. I said for waiting around in case I needed another puzzle later, wouldn't you say? I mean, Doris Day? Ah, oh, forget it. I'm too tired. Kitchen clothes, I need to find a way to make him hungry. Seems he wants to be hungry. Well, that's only sort of true. I'm just always hungry. Eh? Eh. Uh, yeast in this? No. Try everything. Nothing in my room, right? Oh, oh, the ants, 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 the ants. There we go. 
Okay. Uh, a sunsmith. Okay, maybe I had to go back to the pool again. And eh. Here. No. I put this in here? Yet. Uh, in here? In here. In here. I'm unclear. business that's what close the freaking door uh, why are you here no okay oh it's not his signal it's the other guy's signal channels appear to be broken all i can see is food delicious food i'm hungry now i think i'll call a room service hello I like one food please kitchen's closed not because of rats or anything just closed what's it to you how all specific anyway i'm hungry well there's nothing i can do about it oh i know genie yes one food please as you wish look at all this food all the brat wishes a boy could eat. One wish down. But if my burma wishes, I'm going to need to get him out of his room. Aha. And then turn the power off? Here, I'll power down. Let's see if that worked. Boy, it's all hot. So I can't hear to cool off. And then this? No. And then this? Look at my escape plans. I'm working on it. I don't mean to rush you, but I don't want to have to wash. Watch him change clothes again. Come join me in the water. It's adequate. <laughs> uh. 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 Figure it out. Oh, wait, now that he's in there, I can check his room. Breaking people's rooms and going through their stuff is the best birthday ever. Try to find the clues for things he wastes wishes on. It's like his wish got him a nice meal, at least. The label says, power switch for Twin Lakes Hospital. Do not turn off. That can't be right, but I'm not risking it. It's one of those fish that sing. I wonder what song it is. I am Saul, the summoning salmon. You're here to make conjuring your favorite extra planner... Be fun. Bringing forth Mesoloth, the bug liquor, draw ye first pentagram using the blood. Oh, I turn off that. <laughs> the spell works fancy. This vibe. Two of histamine for ant bites called antihistamine. It must be allergic to ants. I may turn these back on later. How come we got a TV in his room? No fair. Fishing rod. Look, I was hoping to fish out something amusing worthy on a trip. I'm gonna borrow this for a moment. Might? Yeah, I'm taking it. <laughs> How's clothes? Got good taste. All expensive designer stuff. Yeah, nice clothes. Shame if something was to happen to them. But you just wash them again. Unless. I love where this is going. Us drawers for dead spiders. Could be worse. Could all be alive. Looks like he got here before us. Well, yeah, it's his room. Damn it. He's on one step ahead of us. Eh? Eh. Child plans. Uh, eh? Okay. Okay, so here we use this here. Because by the way, ants are interested. Need to lure them and ideally traps them. The job of the police force. Oh, this and this. 
Long thing rock covered in honey. Okay. Seem to be going for it. Okay, that's enough for my needs. <laughs> Okay. Put the ants in here. It's horrible. Less horrible than the world altering magical wishes. How bad could it be, really? Well, rumor has it that we used to have summer all around. A guy wish it wasn't so hot all the time. I think I hate that guy. Well, it must be better sure you can't wash him. Okay, so now we gotta go to the laundry room. <laughs> Here goes nothing. We need to get out of here. <laughs> well, that's the machine's ruined. Eh, what'd you say? Nothing. With his clothes infested, he'll want to use these as soon as he gets back to his room. I'll just have to get him there. Okay, I just need to find a way to get him back to his room now. Surely someone around here can help me. Lord, that fellow's even bluer and more see-through than me. Not that. Working on it. Okay. Life ring. The hotel heats. No. Okay. Probably friends of all the swim. Um Oh, talk to the carney, maybe. Hey, how do you get rid of customers who hang around for clothing? We have a say in the business. Bag of crows. Take this and throw it at it. Bag of crows. Off he goes. Uh-huh. Love it. So love it. Miss tells me that they throw whatever it is that exactly people need to leave quickly. I wonder what's inside. I'm having such a relaxing evening. Well, here goes nothing. Ugh, what's happening? Get me out of here. I wish it. As you command. Well, that was an unexpected freebie. What happened out there? I think you were attacked by birds. Ugh, I'm starting to hate this place. Just want to put on some pajamas and go to bed. Ah, oh, there are ants in my pants. Hello, reception. I put my clothes up for a washing, please. Why do you keep calling these services that? Five minutes prior, we were working fine. Is this some kind of elaborate prank? Oh, the laundry room's not working? What? Uh, of course it is. I'm just using it right now to clean my, clean my suds. That's right. And right now, I gotta go put a new batch of suds on. What a disaster. Wish my pants had no ants. Is that a legit for real wish? Yes. Yes, it is. Done. And with that, I am free. Sayonara, sucker. Aw, my wishes. I'm so excited to go home. What's this, a message? I wish I didn't have to go back to work after this trip. Why not, guy? You, you two were good to me. Granted, well, I'm out of here. Spectral delivery. Well, that's taken care of. Ready to go check if you're crashing properly now, Dooley? Dooley, where'd you go? Dooley? Dooley? Oh, no. Something seems... What's the word for not right? Oh no. <gasps> no. And there's no more. What? Oh, that makes me so sad. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me tonight. I really, really appreciate it. Um, don't forget to do all the YouTube -y things, the likey and subscribey and all that fun stuff, and I will see you guys around, okay? Thanks so, so, so much. Bye, everybody.